What's up everybody? I'm Evil Rabbit. We're here on Drift 21. There was a big update with some force feedback updates as well as a new car. So we're gonna hit in Drift 21 today. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. All that you found in the description box below. Let's get to it. All right, so if you guys have been following the channel, you guys know we were working on the 15, which is over here. We did put some wide spaces and everything on it to get somewhat of a fitment. It does have a 1,000 horsepower, and they did say they adjusted the driving feel. So we're going to go take a look at that, but we're also going to be taking a look at the new car. So we have the 15 fully built. We never finished the BRZ, but we now have a Mazda RX-8, which... You know we're going to bring out because, well, why not? So we're going to buy the RX-8 in today's episode, which is going to pretty much drain our credits. So we're going to start getting some credits and stuff like that to start building the car up. So first, we're going to go drive the 1,000 horsepower 15 and see how this does. So we do have North, we do have School, and we have Maname. So I feel like we should just go to Maname. Uh, and free mode. We're just going to go send this and see what we can come up with and see if how the f driving feels differently. So it's not as twitchy now. Oh, I don't think it's not as twitchy at all. It feels a little bit better. Well, as I say that, we kind of... Okay, so that's a little bit better. The wheel, okay, so the wheel still has a bit of a different wheel, you know, feel to it. It's still, I don't believe it's perfect. There's probably some things that could be a little bit better. It doesn't seem to rotate that easy still and it still gets that little bit of slide so there was somebody who told me to change a setting in the game to eliminate that so we're gonna go take a look and see what we can determine oh they have new bases we're gonna go with the Fanatec Fanatec 2.5 base, so it's going to give us a force feedback for that. Okay. All right. That's definitely pretty cool. So I'm trying to figure out what setting somebody was telling me about. It's probably in another setting. Something about uh, automatically press clutch and handbrake, steering limiting engine stall. That's probably the engine stall setting. So. Oh, so now we need ignition. So ignition on, we're going to go here. Ignition off, we're going to go here. Okay. So now let's see what this does. Oh, yep. Now we stalled the car. Can we start the car? Oh, do I not have an ignition? Do I not have a starter button? Oops. Wrong button. Did I not put a starter button now? No ignition on off. There's no starter button. So unsure how that works. So we'll just go back to So now it's set for the fan attack, so let's see how it feels. It does feel a little bit better. I think I'm still just roasting these tires, to be quite honest with you. Yeah, these tires are just getting smoked.
So the feeling of the wheel is a little bit better. It does feel not as bad. We could be slipping the clutch because of, yeah, clutch slip. I think that is our problem. We do have a clutch slip in the car. So apparently our clutch is not good enough. Cause you know, some fourth gear, I get no power. So we definitely need to work on the clutch and stuff in the 15, but we're here to take a look at that RX-8. Let's go back to the garage, take a look at the RX-8. Like I said, it's gonna deplete our funds, but we do have the BRZ to do stuff as well as the S15. We're gonna have to tear the entire S15 apart though, in order to mess with that clutch. We have to pull the engine, pull everything apart. So we will save that for another time. We have parts everywhere. I feel like we should just clean up our garage. Yep. All right. So now let us go and buy a new car and deplete our funds completely. And then we will have to get our funds back. I want to buy that. Yes. So now my question, does it come with a rotary? Because there's still no rotary available in the garage. So I can't open anything? Oh, you can't open anything unless you put it to drift mode. Oh, that's unfortunate. I can't even see what's in there. Your car receives basic modifications. No, all right, well, I guess we're gonna go drive this car first before we send it into oblivion of drifting probably have to pull a motor out of another car but I'm gonna be sad we're gonna lose the rotary rotary gang wrap oh I'm gonna be kind of really sad that we're gonna lose the rotary because from what I know we don't have a handbrake really from what I know, when you do the drift mode, you are gonna basically, it's gonna pull the motor and everything out. Is there a time trial we can do with this to get some money in stock mode? So, we're gonna go see what it does when we actually hit that button for drift mode. I'm gonna be super sad if we lose that rotary because we cannot buy a rotary. Because if you go into buying a warehouse, there is no rotaries. You only have inline four and inline six motors. No rotary motor. Oh, that's sad. Please don't get rid of the motor. Please don't get rid of the motor. Oh, they don't let you keep the rotary in it. Oh, that's super sad. Put a radium in there already though. They don't let you keep the rotary motor in the car. So unfortunately, we are going to have to build a motor or pull the motor out. So if we pull the motor out of there, we could put it in the, you know, the RX-8. But unfortunately, that's gonna gonna definitely make for an unfortunate time we're gonna take off that and see if we can pull this motor off in the stand move to RX-8 okay well then move to engine stand and then take the pipes off Move to RX-8. So we can only put the four banger in the RX-8. That is unfortunate to me and well, that's kind of sad. I was hoping we'd keep the, uh, the rotary in there. Nope, I don't want to drop it on the ground. But unfortunately, they don't have the rotary in there. So that's 
a little bit unfortunate. Let's go put this on the lift. Then we got to put this car in the air and put all the missing bits in it. Like, uh, mm, big intercooler. And then we gotta do the intercooler piping. Do we have enough money for all this? A lot of the stuff we already bought. So luckily a lot of the things other than these new parts are still good and let's do a short gear ratio oh no I didn't want to move that to dino rip we gotta continue and put a bunch of things in this thing so we can get it on the ground and driving I'm very curious as to how it reacts with the turbo in line 4 Hopefully we have enough money to buy all these parts for this. We do, so we're good. Oh, we're gonna have to put the front pipe in there, so yeah. Now don't drop that on the ground. We drop a lot of parts here in Drift 21, if you guys have not noticed. So we're gonna get the front pipe in there. Then I believe we need to put the interior bits in. Maybe put steering wheel in. I think we're just gonna put our normal universal wheel in there. Our big universal handbrake. We need to just put factory seats in for right now. Oh, no, I don't want that. We're just gonna do all the basics on it and we will get more into it later on but today I kind of want to drive this thing so we drove it with the rotary but now we don't have a rotary anymore so now we have a turbo four and we got a lot of clutch slip so So unfortunately, we lost the rotary that was in the car. Still sounds like one though. The physics and the wheel do feel a little bit better now. It's not as, uh, let's say loose. And we're gonna have to be doing some challenges and stuff to get money, so. Before we end this episode off, let's go take a look at if we can do one or two challenges, maybe, and get some cash to reimburse us, because we're down on cash now. So, select mode, solo run, no, wait, we want to go solo, select, that's just, what is this, just a time, you can get, you can get a decent amount of money for that. All right, we'll try it. Apparently you can get 18, 1800 bucks for getting gold in this one. Oh, don't miss click checkpoints. What did we complete it with? Bronze? I mean, all right. So it is quite easy to actually get uh, get some money in here. We'll try and get this faster. Oh, as I say that, we lose it. So if you guys are doing challenges, I really got to fix that clutch slip. We definitely got to fix the clutch slip issues. We got a gold trophy. Earn credits, 2,700. Quick way, easy way to earn money just by doing something like that? Yeah? So did we just gain a lot of money? So that's a quick and simple way to earn some cash in this game. If we actually did, we did. So good news is we can earn cash easily. So now we got, well, 
a couple cars in our garage here. I think before we leave, we should definitely and try and make a basket because I did find the basketball hoop outside. So make sure you guys follow me on Instagram and Twitter, all of which found in the description box below. If I make this, please hit that subscribe button. Ah, oh, well, I mean, you could probably still hit that subscribe button if you would like. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. Apparently, I'm really bad at basketball in Drift 21. So, as always, I thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. Oh, I think that went in, but it glitched. I'll see you guys on the track.